Global warming. One of the few global disasters of the 21st century, which is almost indefinitely coming. Are you ready? So what, pray tell, is global warming? Well, Mrs. Raymond Heimner, global warming is the gradual heating of a planet, which may indefinitely bring a massive flood to our lovely planet and kill us all. Oh my! Yes, oh my is correct. We have been causing this for centuries now with our cars releasing greenhouse causing gases. Oh, my, my greenhouse! Oh, not like that, Mrs. Wormen Hamner. Greenhouse gases are actually what keeps our nice blue planet warm and green by catching the sun's rays and heat. But too much gases and our planet is in trouble. Like my gas! <laughs> Ew. Greenhouse gases? Isn't that the stuff that comes out of your eyes? Daddy says the global warming is just a way for the commie brainwashing Democrats to scare everybody and steal our money. God bless George W. Bush. Isn't that some kind of newfangled dance craze with kids? Oh, damn near a bumping and a humping. Isn't it pretty disgusting? Global warming, what in tolerations of global warming with them marching penguins and the floating turtle bears? God, warm, at least it'd be warm when I'm asleep on my cardboard. <sighs> Aliens are coming to get you, you better hide. Double you. Anyway, global warming is a global crisis. It could potentially raise sea levels and increase global temperatures, which can be dangerous for many. That's why it's up to you to prevent that from ever happening. For instance, you could... Recycle plastic and old recyclable materials. Recycling! Limit your air conditioning uses during the summer. Oh, it's so hot today. I think I'll use my air conditioner. No, on second thought, maybe I'll just sweat. Refrain from using aerosol products such as air fresheners that spray. Don't do that! Or even interest your parents in a hybrid electric car. Remember, kids, it's up to you. That's right. If you don't, the consequences could be dire. Ah, the heat! Ah, ah, ah. Here in Africa, it's so hot we have nothing to drink. Asia, there is no more rice to feed us, so we must eat bamboo, like panda. <laughs> I'm so sunburnt that it chipped off, and I used to be so much darker, so much darker. I now uh, carry my parasol for fear. You used to look a, young, a lot younger. Now I look like I'm 65. I'm only 15. Fear. We used to use the sea for irrigation, but now we live in fear. It's coming. <laughs> isn't it? But it doesn't have to happen. All we need to do is work together and we will make a difference. It's, it's up, up to, to you! you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>
with the match of the penguins and whatnot. I don't know what I'm supposed to <laughs>